This is Brett Waltemath of Starwatch Media here at the 2012 Los Angeles Film Festival for the world premiere of the dark comedy Red Flag. Brett with Starwatch Media, now you're the director of Four. Can you please tell us a little bit about the project and your inspiration behind the project? Um, yeah, it's a film about two couples that are on um, dates on the 4th of July and um, one of them is a, a middle-aged college professor who is out on a date with a 16-year-old boy that he's met on the internet and his teenage daughter kind of suspects that this is happening and it's sort of about like the disruption of their family based on his secret life. Um, it's based on a play by a writer named Christopher Shin, who um, is an incredibly gifted and talented writer. And, um, and uh, I was just a big fan of his work. And um, uh, when I read this play, I thought it would be an incredible movie. And um, so that's kind of how I got involved with the project. What is it about his work specifically that uh, you really respect and enjoy? Um, he really deals with a kind of um, like a, a sort of American um, kind of underbelly of um, what I think we all kind of think and feel, and, it, and it's a much more kind of psychological, um, in-depth kind of analysis of what of, of what his characters are that really appeals to me. Um, and I think he's such a, a fresh voice um, in American writing that we don't we have so little of these days. Um, so it's, uh, I was really attracted to it for that reason. As a director, do you like dealing more with, uh, with, with films that would have more of a psychological twist? Is that a passion of yours? What genres do you like to work with in? Um, I don't know if a psychological twist is so much what I'm into. I mean, I, I don't really know if I'm really, I mean, I don't really work in any kind of genre. I mean, most of the, the films I do are pretty, like, um, you know, they're like dramatic films, but they're 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 more based on like real people, you know, and and um, the kind of psychology of real people in real situations. So um, there's really no twist to it or anything. It's just um, about like a, people going through um, a conflict in their life. You know? How would you best describe your directing style? Um, <laughs> that's a good question. I uh, I guess I would describe it as pretty actor driven. I mean, I I um, I tend to really enjoy working with actors the most and I, I like to really get involved in what their process is and uh, casting is, a, is a, like the most important thing to me it's it you know really dictates everything that the film becomes uh, and the work that you are able to do with actors before the film starts to happen um, so that when you get on the set what you're getting from them is is um, natural and um, you know and, and not forced um, so uh, I guess that would kind of describe it would you say that with your actors you have very key and specific direction with them or do you like to uh, just be more free-flowing and let kind of their talent really come off naturally on screen? Um, I would say it's probably more free-form in the sense that I, I like to have I like time with them before I, I, I work with them be, be, you know, to get to know who they are. And um, a lot of the work that I think that we did on this film came from uh, their own kind of in-depth analysis of the characters and what they were bringing to it, you know. Um, but you can't really go, you can't really like cast somebody and, and you know, make them be who they're, who they're not, you know. It doesn't work that way. So um, when I'm on set, I, I don't really give them a lot of direction because they've already formed what they're doing so well, you know, that um, I, 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 I view my job as mostly kind of trying to create a safe space for them to be able to do what they, they need to do with the characters. And it seems to me that a lot of actors, they respect that type of direction where you still allow them to work within their craft that they've worked so hard to develop over time. Yeah, I mean, a lot of actors do respect that, and, um, you know, I, every actor has their own process, and, um, you know, the actors that worked on this film, I think, took a big risk as far as the material that they were dealing with, and, and having to really go the extra mile to to figure out who these characters were are, and, and to make them real, you know, and not, not every actor in the... In, you know, in, in movies or in theater, or, you know, not all of them are, are willing to do that because it's hard, you know, because it's really difficult. What would you like the audience to take away from the story and the film? Um, I would like them to, to um, feel as if the characters and, and the story that we've presented to them, while it might make them unsettled or uncomfortable, um, relates maybe to, to something that they've experienced or something that they've, they've seen other people experience. And I think that we made a film that is about real people 
and about um, real struggles that real people have. And um, uh, so I, 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 I would hope that you know people could walk away from this movie feeling as if it echoed something back to them that they felt but maybe couldn't express. You know. I'll do one last question. Other projects for you, upcoming projects that you're currently working on. Um, I have some like a few things kicking around. I'm not really sure. I mean, they're in really like early stages. Um, uh, too early to kind of talk about, but um, I'm mostly just kind of finished. I mean, we, we, we finished this film really recently, so it's been kind of a lot of work putting it out there and and um, sort of processing like how it's going to be received and what's going to happen with it. So it's um, I'm mostly focused on that right now. Excited to see the crowd's reaction tonight? I was, yeah. It was exciting. And, um, you know, you never really know what... Um, every audience is different, so you never really know what 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 their reaction is going to be so it's I mean that's part of, of what is exciting and interesting about making films is that you you get to really bear witness to these stories with people and have a dialogue with them about what what has happened you know and that's part of what's great about about the movies you know so it was it was really exciting for me and, and really amazing thank you for the time sir enjoy the rest of the festival appreciate thank it thank you sir